Good morning, y'all. What's going on? Welcome back to a brand new video. Heading to the DMPs this morning. We got some uh, some deer to feed, some corn. Our daily uh, morning feed. They got protein in here, but um, just like to give them some corn. Corn's like candy to them. Um, so we're gonna give about half half a uh, bucket of corn in the front pen. This is where Hercules is, and then we're gonna head to the back of the property and give the uh, the rest of the bucket to a uh, soldier and all the girls back in the back DMP pen. Before we get started with today's video, if you're not subscribed to the channel, subscribe to the channel. We're posting every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Hit that sub button, hit that notification button. And if you did not see, uh, my last video, I went over the DMP pens, both the front and the back. I showed y'all shoulders and Hercules sheds. Y'all must take a look at that video. Um, it's the previous video before this one. Um, but yeah, guys, make sure to subscribe. We got a lot of great content coming um, for the rest of winter, coming in the spring, and then on to summer when we got the fishing videos. We're gonna go ahead, we got the front uh, pen, pen fed here. We're gonna head to the back and um, feed Soldier's Pen. All right, so we're at Soldier's Pen now. Um, I'm not gonna go inside this one. Uh, I'm just gonna corner it from the outside. Give him and some of those does some uh, some feed other than protein. And like I said, if you want to learn more about these pens, um, take a look at my last video. I go over a little bit about who Soldier is. Um, I'll just show you all a little bit about the pens. We got protein in these feeders. We got water over there. Um, it's about a 10 acre pen. So take a look at that video. Uh, I think y'all enjoy it. All right, so now we're gonna transfer over. I'm gonna go back a couple days. Um, a clip where I was building a brand new millennial buck hunt blind um, to, to basically archie hunt out of. Um, it's a multi-purpose blind, you can rifle hunt out of it. So we're gonna go back a couple days. When I was making that blind, it took eight hours to make. Um, and then we're gonna come back to today and we're gonna head over to that blind. I'm gonna show you all the inside and what it looks like standing up. We're building a millennial buck hunt blind. Um, I saw these on Cabela's and Bass Pro Shop a while back. I've been watch, looking at them over and over again, looking at the reviews and all, good, all that good stuff. And I finally uh, pulled the trigger on one just because, honestly, I need a new blind. Uh, we have a lot of areas on the property that are, you know, there's a vast span between one blind to the other uh, where we could stick another blind in there. Um, reason I went with Millennial, their blinds are cheap, guys. I found these blinds um, during Black Fl Friday, actually, and they were like $700. Um, now, after Black Friday, their normal price is like $830. Something ridiculous. You get a tower stand. Um, you get the whole thing. That's the, that's the beauty about it. You don't just get the frame. You don't just get the actual blind part. You get both. So, um, apparently, it takes eight hours to build. Yeah, we'll see. I mean... I thought like, nah, no way, eight hours. Oh no, it's it's gonna take all of eight hours. So what I did, I organized all the all the pieces out into different um, sections here. You can see we got this is the flooring. This is the um, this is the uh, exterior that goes around the blind, the fabric. We got a ladder, a couple ladders. We've got some frames, some legs. Some other stuff, some other stuff, some other stuff, and then I've been building this. This is the uh, this is the floorboard. I've been building this for an hour. <laughs> it comes in four different pieces. Been bolting bolts, 12 bolts here, 24 bolts here. I'm putting this section part on right now, and the manual is actually pretty decent, honestly. I'll have to say, pretty good manual so far. And then you can see over here all the different bolts we got going on. So this is gonna be a process. This is gonna take, I mean, it's gonna take all day for sure. Even maybe even two days. Two days later, she is about, about finished. Not completely, about finished. What a process. When it said, um, the plan flip said eight hours. Oh, it took all of eight hours. This is what we got here. Frame is basically, it is completely done. We got it up on its side. This thing is heavy, steady. Um, I mean, everything that you want from a blind, it's got, um, looks really reliable. Here's the frame. Um, this is the front side of the blind. We got working down here. We got all the legs. I mean, guys, this is made of high quality stuff. 
Uh, there's adjustable legs here depending on the height you want on both sides. This is the bottom of it. A little 360 here. I haven't put the ladder on yet. This is where the ladder is going to go. Um, these are the handles. That's the ladder over there. And guys, you can see, I mean, this, this is heavy duty stuff. Here's the flooring um, that will go on the floor. And here's the tarp that will go around the blind. Um, it's a pretty nice tarp. Um, it holds, I think it's, man, I want to say maybe eight windows um, to shoot out of. And so the guys, this is a bow blind, but it's also a rifle blind. Bow blind because all the windows are vertical. It'll explain a lot better uh, once it's up. But if you're shooting rifle, these are a rest for rifle. And if you come down here, got little things pull out like this on both sides. And then you can actually adjust and move this depending on the height you want um, when you're sitting and stuff. And you can just rest the rifle right on there. I'll explain it more once I get it up and going. We're trying to make it both a bow and rifle blind. So it's going to be a little hard to do. We got to put it in the exact perfect location. So we'll see if we can do that. But y'all stay tuned. And right now we're going to go see, see a location and put this bad boy. All right, y'all. So this is what it looks like from the outside. All right, so when you get to the door, it's got a shooting window on the back side of the door, and it's just a zip, um, a zipper, a heavy duty zipper. Guys, this is not a little uh, janky stuff. This is the real deal. Take a look how big this is. It can hold two, two hunters 100% perfectly with room to spare. Um, it's got a nice flooring. We'll start here. Let me open some of these windows because it's really dark in here. So the windows, they just zip up like this. Hold up. So they zip up like this, and then this is your top window, right? So all you got to do is got a little magnet. You can magnet it to the top of the top of the roof, just like that, and you're good to go. And then the bottom, just zip it down, just like this. And guys, look, you have a whole window right here to bow hunt out of. Um, they're big windows too, and the good thing about these, the great thing about these is. Uh, if you don't want it this big, you can just zip the window up, right? To the exact height you want. If you want a smaller window for um, kind of more protection, you, you can do that as well. So it's just zippers right here. So you can see bottom zips down, top zips up. So I'll show y'all here if you want like a smaller window to shoot out of. Then you got a magnet here and you're just gonna magnet this to the top, guys. A bit magnet right here. It's got a magnet right here. Oh, it's hard to do this with one hand as I got the camera on. But magnet, magnet. Look at that. You got a smaller window, just like that. So depending on what you want, and there's a bunch of windows. Like I said, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, plus the door. That's ten windows. You're not gonna want all these windows open. You're gonna want maybe one here, one here, maybe every other, um, depending on your preference and where you are shooting. What I love about this, and y'all, y'all archery hunters out there, uh, you can just wear all black. These these blinds are totally black. So why would you wear camo when you could just wear black and blend in with the blind um, to act like no one's even in it? You know. So that's that's the great thing about these. They're all black. And this this is the cool part, right? I said, oh, this is all for bow and archery and all that good stuff. But wait, there is right here, rifle rests, um, you can call them that. Um, so what they do is they unlock like this, right? And all you do, move it up. So it's a bar, right? Wherever your preference is. And then you, let's say, let's say it's right here. This is perfect, your height. Clip it down, clip it down. And take a look guys you have a perfect perfect um, rest for your rifle and the good thing about them they have them on each window even these longer windows guys bar going all the way across for rifle um, my buddy actually shot a giant buck out of this window uh, this is actually he was actually the first one to shoot so I'm out of this blind we just got this blind built um, out of this window with this rest so it's, it's it works both for you know archers and rifle guys and let's say you're an archer this is in your way right unclip it unclip it you can move it up or down right like i said it's hard to do this with one hand and then you're good to go clip it back down boom you're set